Hi guys, welcome to PS Pro, another tutorial. In this tutorial, I'm going to try to try and relax you because a lot of people, when you start looking at uh, Photoshop for the first time, it can be very overwhelming and almost enough to put you off and not make you want to get started creating lots of cool things uh, for your business or for whatever it is that you're learning Photoshop for. So the first thing you need to do is head on up over here to Window select workspace and then just click essentials and what that what's that's going to do is bring you up the basic easiest way uh, of learning photoshop the most simplest form of layout so what you got is over here you've got all of your tools at the moment i'm just going to ignore this top banner because that's actually responsive so down here you've got all your different tools that we're going to be learning how to use over the uh, upcoming days weeks months years or whatever uh, you've got basically whatever you select from here you can see it starts making the actual top tools up here change so there's very little point trying to do a massive tutorial video talking about every single part of the actual workspace because depending on what you're doing the workspace can change instantly just with a click as you can see but normally nine times out of ten when you open up Photoshop or you're starting on a new document this is what you see if you've got it set to essentials so you've got the dynamic bar at the top which changes relevant to the tools that you're selecting now you only need to be working on one tool at a time and as you're learning those tools I'll be walking you through the different features and the different options that comes about with the tools at the top here but so you've got the tools on the side and then the third most important thing is over here you've got your layers now Photoshop works preliminarily uh, because there's there it takes advantage of a fact called layers now we're going to talk about layers more in depth in another tutorial but really what layers does is it enables us to create awesome graphics and overlay uh, different images upon different images as long as we keep layers uh, to a simple level we can literally very easily move things around the paper. Now, not the best example because it's a black background, but if I create a new layer real quick, and I'm all I'm going to do in this case is I'm going to head on over here. Uh, I'm going to use a brush tool, which we're going to talk about in a minute, so don't worry about trying to keep up. And I'm simply going to draw a white line across the actual image. Now, because I've got the white line here on one layer and the actual logo on another layer if I click the white line I can just move that around behind the layer so if that was on a flat bit of paper obviously you couldn't do that if you weren't using layers you'd actually use uh, or you'd actually move both images at the same time like that and I'm going to show you what I did there in a later tutorial so really that's it I'm going to turn that off because it's all nasty as you can see very simple, tools on the left hand side, layers on the right hand side, making sure that workspace is set to essentials. That is it guys, that's all you need to worry about at this stage. Hopefully that's going to make learning Photoshop a little less daunting for some of you and I'll see you in another video. Cheers for watching, bye bye.